Hello, this is the Street Stocks at Five Flags Speedway. Haven't run the Street Stocks in a long time. So this should be fun. Um, I think eight people signed up. Ten people signed up. Strength of field is a 1.6. I'm about in the middle, so... One split, obviously, so we'll see what we can do. There's cautions in this series. I don't think there's any real reason to pit. Um, so I bought Five Flags Speedway last week to, clear. Watch the to try line. to make Nick's league race, and then I did not make the cut. But I knew this was a track that would come up in all the short track series that I like to run, so I didn't feel like it was a waste of money. Not like LA Coliseum, where... I don't know if I'll ever use that track again. So. This is my first chance to get to use the track in an actual race. They only give you one set of tires, right? This is not good. That's a 2x that accounts. Not at full strength, but it counts. I don't know the answer to that question, but I'm pretty Take sure care, a car approaching. that yes, you only get one set of tires. I think a finish around my car number is the goal. That's a new fastest lap for Cole, 18.4. The leader has just done 18.4. I'm glad to see the number one 3,000 plus I rating guy also spun out. So. Feeling a little different than the practice I just came out of, a little more loose. New fastest lap for Cole, 18.3. I don't really know the right way to drive around here, but I kind of figured out a line that didn't actually use any brakes. So yeah, it's been a while since I've run these. I feel That's like I've only run them a few times. E3. I kind of wish I could Maybe there's a way to look up your entire race history in iRacing. I don't know. But I, I have, like, no memory. And this is less, only about a year ago. No memory of the rookie street stocks. Like, I feel like I got out of them so Your fast. It's clear. Don't cross the white line. We have two laps to get the job done, mate. I never won any races in them or anything like that. All right, concentration time. Green flag, green flag. Okay, here comes your first time black. Let's just put down a lap first to maybe get ahead of some of those really low I rated people if possible. And then try a little harder on this lap. Pole position. AKA screw up a little harder. <laughs> Pull position, but I had been the only one to put in a lap at that point. I'm now in second. The number one car has beat me. As he P2. All right. This kick is flag. Should really do. Tim Duggar was in the practice with me. He beat my best lap by just a hair. I assume he's got better than a 22 and maybe he's just using that lap to warm up his tires for a real good run. Yeah, that's about where he was. I was right around there, but I'm okay. I don't... I just want to get in this race and hope nothing bad happens. Hope it's a fun time. I will skip ahead through this in case it takes three minutes. I don't have anything to really say, so I'll see you for grid up. Okay, we are back. P4. Only six people put in a lap. Don't know why. I'm figuring a track like this and a car like this, you'd rather start more towards the front. Starting in the outside, which is never awesome. Let's go race. You're on the outside this time. Closed. Pit road is closed. Mm -hmm. 
yeah, it's been a while. Probably, yeah, I'd have to look at my channel. I know I've done a race or three in this car on my channel. But, I kind of remember them being caution fest, but this is only eight cars, or ten. I keep thinking eight because it said eight signed up. The last thing I noticed, but when I got in here, there was actually ten. But still, that's not a lot of cars. Well, this is a small track. So yeah, like I said, I'm not going to fall into the trap of buying a track just for somebody's hosted thing. In case I don't make it or in case it goes poorly. But I felt okay buying this one, even though I didn't end up making it. Because I knew it was one I was going to want eventually anyway. And one week later, here I am running it. And that the tour mods will come here, the late models will come here. And I'll be fine. I'll have fun running all of those. So, LA Coliseum, though, <laughs> not that it was a lot. Of, I mean, I spend 10, 15 bucks on dumber things that I got no value out of in the long term. But still, it's just something I want to be aware of. I did buy a car just to do Gavin's hosted race, but it was literally $3. That car will probably, unless Gavin uses it again in a hosted race, that car is probably going to collect dust too, but $3 for an hour of entertainment or whatever I got out of it didn't seem like a big waste of money either. And to be fair, Nick's wouldn't have seemed like a big waste of money if I wouldn't have been punted two laps in and that was it for me. I never was able to get back. But anyway, we got a race here to worry about now. Uh, stuff that happened last well earlier this year I don't remember when it's been a while is that the pole sitter deciding to take the high line I'm confused my sound might get my voice might get a little worse but I have to move the mic a little this left monitor is pointless if I can't see what's actually there this is a problem that I need to solve yet. What to do with my mic. One left to green. It might be something as simple as, even though this is a pretty nice mic that I spent money on, until I can figure it out, I probably should just put the freaking mic back on this headset and just use it. It sounds so much worse, but at least it can be right by my mouth. And won't be blocking my view of things. Maybe I'll have to do that. I just, it didn't even occur to me until like literally right now. I don't know what gear to start. I'm just going to go with second. Here we go. Gary's off. Green, 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 green. Seven just dove it in there. Inside. They're inside. But he made it work. I ain't You got excited, didn't you? How many laps is this? 60, okay. I wasn't paying any attention. I, I'm assuming there's no time. I don't remember pitting being a thing you would think to do in these cars. And it's not D class or well, well, so there's 18. no. 3. The lap time was at 18.5. The guy behind has just done a 18.3. P5. I'm driving real slow, I think. Kind of like. I gotta pick it up. The guy behind me was two tenths faster, according to crew chief, and I felt the luck to approve it. Yeah, when the seven dove it under me, I'm like, wow, I'm just going to get taken out, but he just made it work and wasn't even close. Good on him. Sliding up. I've been getting a little squirrely there. Dude, I'm there. Oh, you definitely made yourself there, that's for sure. 
I can't. I was making the corner and you come down on me. I had a big run on you. You hit me, I didn't hit you. You've just done a 18.4. So when it's all said and done, just chop the nose off the guy behind you. It had nothing to do with it. Thank you. You're lucky I didn't run you over. What's the seven talking about? Ladies, ladies, only a street stock race. Yeah, I ain't being like that. I'm just saying, whatever. Ain't no ladies here. Yeah, I just want to have a clean race. I didn't want to get into him. Well, you sure sound like him. Let these guys entertain you for a little bit. I was going to let you go anyways, but your tires are going to be dead by the end of this. Yeah, I have no idea how my tires are going to behave. <laughs> well, that was at 18.4. I've gotten a little separation I'll do it from the guy behind me. Day. I'm just having fun. As I say that, I see him getting bigger in the mirror again. You've just done a 18.6. But apparently I ran a two-tenths slower lap than the last one, so consistency isn't really my thing right now. as well as I was hoping this race would go. say that in the car, but well, it doesn't help that I'm up to by two freaking lanes. Alright, let's gather it up. Maybe something will happen that really can some spots back. Now, 0 .5 P7. I got that spot back. Sixth place. Must have got loose. Went to the inside wall. The gap in front is now 0.7. But now the red and blue car behind me is catching, I think. I'm just driving this all wrong, I think. The more I run this stuff, hopefully the better I get at it. I mean, the tour mods, these, the late models. Because I like the short track racing a lot. I'm just not necessarily very good at it. screwed up. 
Let's get it back under control. My right hand is killing me. Relax the grip a little bit. Jeez. That was almost the wall again. I need to figure out why that's a thing I'm doing all of a sudden. B6. got a long ways to go yet, and this race does have the potential to have cautions. The gap in front is now 0.9. That guy that passed me and then got loose at the inside wall, I don't remember which car that was, but I'm sure he has the potential to come back to us at some point, too. Especially if he gets a yellow to catch him up. That lap time was 18.8. This just isn't very good by me. Joined this race kind of on a prayer that enough people would sign up for it to go official. And it was looking bad for a while. 1.1 seconds. That was a uh, 18.6. Consistency is big. So I know I've run 18.8s, 18.6s. Two tenths is a long time on this on a track like this. Feeling quite loose now. A little too loose. We're halfway in the race. That's it. Oh man. <laughs> You're halfway home. Got plenty of fuel. Yeah, this is a fixed setup if I didn't mention that. So can't blame setup on anything. The gap in front is now 1.2. That's where you coming up a little bit. <laughs> that lap time was 18.7. Okay, Justin, that's good consistency. Keep it up. Delta at all-time optimal. That's not that helpful. I mean, I can compare uh, how much it's down to each one to kind of give an idea of how my lap is consistency-wise. Like the last one was 0.53 off. This is looking to be similar, so that shows you a consistent lap at least. Session last would be the better. Gap ahead is now 1.5 seconds. The gap ahead is just getting bigger with every lap. So, assuming nothing shakes this all up or I don't screw up big, sixth place is looking like the finish out of 10. Not great. These guys really, like, somehow have worse tires than me all of a sudden. I don't know how I'm doing on my tires. Literally no idea. The gap in front is now 1.5 seconds. I feel like I'm heating up the right rear with stuff like that. The gap behind is now 1.7 seconds. That lap was a 18.8. Some side by side up there. Maybe the seven will come back to me. The next car is Miller. Let's just try to have consistent laps and see. I couldn't tell if that was real for a second. It didn't look like it could possibly be real, but at the same time, I'm like, it didn't correct itself very quickly. Justin, your 
Reeling, Miller. In. The gap is now 1.1 seconds. That lap was at 18.7. Try to keep the right rear happy. I'm feeling like that's what's suffering right now. Because I'm sliding the rear end around a lot. Just got to keep it happy. Don't want to spin out. The lap time was at 18.8. .8. That's good consistency. Keep it up. Someone disconnected. So I won't get dead last anyway. Something got real loose there. I'm gonna just try not to be the same. He's definitely struggling more than me, it looks like. So I got plenty of laps to make this happen. The gap to Miller ahead is now 0.8. That lap time was 18.9. Looks like he's gathered it up a little bit. I haven't seen any big loose moments out of him. Keep it out of the wall. You've just done a 18.8. lap time was at 18.9. The gap to Miller in front is now 0.7. Not gaining on him fast enough though, maybe. I feel like I gained quite a bit. Oh, he lost some speed dragging the You've hall. You've just done out, a 18.8. Sure. He's really struggling. Now the problem is going to be getting around him. Once I get a little bit closer. That last lap was at 18.9. 18.9s, 18.8s, 18.7s. I haven't heard 10 to go yet, so. I said a few last time was 18.8. See, sometimes. He's not always slower, I don't think, but he's having moments. That's a moment. Car outside. Car outside. Hold, Hold, your line. Line. Hold your line. The gap behind has now decreased to 1.7. That was a 18.9. Clear high. Is clear. Just gotta be careful. I'm not so much faster than him that I'm going to. Well, he keeps taking lines like that. I'm like, no, no, he got a big run. I hope he's not so You're aggressive that he doesn't realize. Well, no, he's not giving it up. So I need to slowly but surely pull away from him if I can. Well, now all of a sudden he's way back there in the mirror. <laughs> I was watching my corner, not my go. mirror. Still 10 laps to go? Alright. Alright, I'm enough ahead of him. I mean, I don't want to screw up and let him back to me, but at least I don't have to worry about getting taken out each corner. Not saying any of these guys Thank are going to do that. Just, it's easy to even accidentally do with close racing, you know? Especially when your corner speeds are a little different. Like, I might be slower in the center than he is because he went in harder, or I'm getting a better drive out. But for a moment there, those two strategies... Put your car in the same spot, you know what I mean? Hopefully I remember to look at my tires after this. I, I'm always so curious and then end of race stuff. My brain immediately moves on to other things. I'm not in the clear for keeping ahead of this guy, I don't think. If I can't gather it up a little better than I am right now. Johnson is now leading. Oh. Lead change? Did somebody have a problem or was it a pass? Somebody had a 
problem. It's a potential position. Really bad exit there. I had to basically Five left to go. bail on the throttle. Cap two. Villa well. behind is now 0.9. 0.9. So there's obviously something I'm doing wrong compared to the route, the fastest guys in this race. Because I would imagine I'm many, many seconds behind first. It's looking like I'm like eight the seconds behind. I just got kind of got to look at that. Yeah, behind. Two more. Let's go. Uh, yeah, I see the leader in my relative behind me now. So I got two to go. I should be able to hold on to this. I two am the number left. five car, and I'm in fifth, so I would not be upset with performing where I'm supposed to. White flag. Stay smooth. One more time around. Then what happened? One more lap to go. The gap to Miller. Good win, man. We should have done it without the crowd. We just good done man. a 18.8. No, I'm not trying to brag about the win. What I'm trying to tell you is, like, that move that you made, yeah, I mean, you were slamming it on entry, dude. Save it a little bit, you know, have something at the end. That's why you felt for your second off. You were slamming it in so damn hard. All you got to do is back that entry off a little bit. You'd have been right there. Great job. You did really well. He ain't ran these cars in a while, and I was, hell, I was just happy to be running them, but good, good, good job, home, uh, keeping, keeping cars, cars, I thought you and the woman were going to have a really good battle, but you had it made up. Oh, no, we did have a good battle, he just, the one really fell off there at the end, too. I just capitalized, but I guarantee you're right front or right rear, I don't know if you're getting loose or tight, but I guarantee it's roasted, what are your tires? Sixty-six on the right. But when I dove it in there, I only hit what, um... Alright. Let's see what happened out there and get out of this race. Uh... I gotta learn the uh, camera controls. I see some people, they don't have to sit and click on these buttons, they just make it work. Alright. I kinda wanna see my start a little bit. Seven just. My start was bad. Like, maybe I started in the wrong gear, I don't know. Yeah, that 66 is, is uh, really low. Mine was 74. Your right rear is toast. And your right front was toast, because mine was 86. Yeah, I raced, I raced hard. I'm telling you what you need to do, dude. Just stop slamming it in so much on the entry, and you'll be better. No. That's what got me around the floor. You can't drive in that hard and save tires. You just can't. Yes, we get it. We get it. I don't know if I was driving it in that hard. Maybe. But good yeah. race, man. Yeah, you too, man. Good win. I don't know if this is going to be much other than wall hits. Try to get through this a little better. Yeah, I guess the four was never in danger of coming back to me. 
I'm at 55 already. Yeah, the one just fell off, I guess, and that's when we heard a new leader. He just kept falling off. Uh, I don't. Might as well. Oh, I did have a wall scrape coming to the white, didn't I? Not an insignificant one either. All right, that was the street stocks at Five Flags. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.